us to help out today at his pet store. It's a good thing we like to count. Why? What does he want us to do? He needs to figure out exactly what he has in his store, and he's asked us to help count his fish. What does he keep his fish in? Tanks. You're welcome, but where does he keep the fish? I said tanks. You're welcome, but... Oh, never mind. We'll see when we get there. Let's go. Oh. Come on, Bass Hound. Maybe you can help, too. Let's go. Everybody counts. Everybody counts. Counting is fun. Fun for everyone. Hello, Math Monsters. Glad to see you. Thanks for helping out. No Don't problem. mention it. You're welcome. Taking an inventory is hard work. An inventory? What's that? When I take an inventory, I count up all the things I sell in the store. So I know exactly how many and what kinds of things I have. Like fish and birds and snakes and, and, and fish food and bird seed and dog bones and things like that. I do it once a year. Mm. What can we do? I can use your help to count how many fish there are in all the tanks in my store. Where do we start? You can begin right here. Count the fish, and when you're done, write the number down on this piece of paper that's taped to the side. Okay, that sounds like fun. See you in a while. Thanks again. I'll count, I'll count, okay? Sure. And I'll write the number down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 
How many fish in that tank, Multiplex? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Should I write down all those numbers? No, Mina. Multiplex counted fourteen fish in all. So only write down fourteen. Wait a minute. That doesn't look right, does it? See? Well, it was a little hard to count, because all the fish were swimming around. Well, what can we do to make it easier? I have an idea. Why don't we catch the fish in a net, one at a time, and put them in another bowl? Each time we take one out, we'll count it. That way, we'll be sure we don't count any fish twice, or miss any. Good idea. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Whoops. Whoa. Let me try again. Gotcha. Uh-oh. Uh Missed. I'll catch them. Wait, Multiplex. I can't count them. They're too fast. So what can we do? Hey, I have an idea. Suppose we use their color to help us keep track of how many there are and then draw them. What do you mean? I'll show you. I see three different colors of fish. There are two red fish, so I'll draw them in red, like this. How many blue fish, Addison? Three. Three blue. How many green? There are two green. Two green. So this is how many fish there are in this tank. How many is that? Seven. Hey, that's a great way to tell how many fish there are. Come on, Split. Let's do the next tank. Well, there are a lot more fish in this tank. I know, but let's get started. There are one, two, three, four, five redfish. I don't like drawing fish very much. I wonder if there is another way we can keep track. got an idea. Instead of drawing, let's just make colored marks, one for each fish. Great idea. Let's start again. I see three red fish there and two more here. So that's one, two, three, four, five. Five red fish. I see three blue fish, two green fish. Any more? Nope, that's it. Okay. That's how many fish there are in this tank. Well, how many is that? Ten. Wow, look what we have here. It's a tank of kangaroo jumping fish. I really love them. And they're very well trained. All you need to do is blow a whistle, and one will jump right out of the water. Really? Sure, I'll show you. When you blow this whistle, what a surprise. A fish will jump right before your eyes. They jump high. They jump low. They jump fast. And they jump slow. They jump from one tank to another at its side. Across a space that's big and wide. Forward and backward in the air. They love to jump everywhere. Wow. wow. It looks like you're doing some very good work here. But I better get back to counting my other things. Wow. There are even more fish in this tank. And they're all the same color. They look exactly alike. How can we possibly figure out how many there are? I don't know, because the calculator is depending on us. What can we do? I've 
got an idea. Let's put a tank with some fresh water and some really delicious fish food right next to this one. Each time we blow the whistle, one fish should jump over for a little snack. Each time one jumps, we'll make a mark to keep track. Great idea! I'll keep score. One. My turn! Two. Three. Addison, I'll blow a whistle with you and then another two fish will jump across. Ready? Four. Five. Hey everybody, let's blow our whistles all together. All together again. Now, one at a time. That's a lot of marks. How many are there all together? I have an idea. This is five. And this is five. That's ten. Let's circle it and mark it with an X. And this one has five and five also. Five of five is ten. Right. So we'll circle and mark this one too. Now we have two groups of ten. And ten and ten makes twenty. And there are three jumping fish left over in the first tank. So when we add those, it makes 23 in all. I wonder if those strange creatures called human beings ever need to take inventory. Or show how many things there are of something. <laughs> sure we do. We keep track and count all kinds of things. Hi, my name is Diane. I work here at the supermarket. Right here at the checkout counter. And inventory is very important so that we know how much product we have on our shelves. That way, when people come in for their favorite foods, everything's on hand. One of the tools that helps us is this electronic scanner. And everything nowadays comes with a barcode like this. This barcode holds all kinds of information, especially the name of the product. When we pass the barcode over the scanner, the information goes right into the computer. And this scanner works the same for all the products in the store. We use other kinds of scanners too, like this one, which helps the computer keep track of the exact number of each product in the store. Math Monsters, you've done a great job! And I'm almost finished! I just can't seem to find one bag of dog bones! But I'll keep looking while you finish up! Then I'll take you all out for some gollywopple pie! Thanks, Thanks Cousin Calculator! Calculator. You're welcome! When we're done with this inventory Then we'll know the whole fish story We won't stop until we're through So let's get back to, to work, work, guys! There's a lot to do! Everybody counts! Everybody counts! Counting is fun! Fun for every